Tennessee pastor Greg Locke is uh, in the news again uh, for saying insane things. Uh, in fact, at a, uh, uh, at, a, at a rally on Monday, he told the crowd that he was going to authorize the use of guns against media figures or anybody playing quote unquote Democrat games. Uh, or spreading propaganda. I don't know what he means, but here, let's just, uh, well, uh, let's just let him explain. And we have to stop compromising to the propaganda. So I say this and we volley back. One of the things we did to push back against the nonsense is not only put up the sign, but we told our folks, we so believe in our First Amendment right to gather under this tent and to worship Jesus Christ, that if you show up with your propaganda machine and you try to impede on our First Amendment right, I said, our boys will meet you at the door of this tent with our Second Amendment right because we're not playing your Democrat games. This is a church, and we're going to stand. Okay, I still don't understand what he's trying to say. Who's, who's trying to interrupt your church? Who, who's trying to interrupt your gathering? And even so, th that doesn't give you the authority to shoot someone. I, I don't understand where you think you get that authority to order people to shoot other people who might be using their First Amendment. I believe in the First Amendment so much that I'm going to use my Second Amendment to shut down your First Amendment. Wait, wait, what? I'm sorry, that doesn't make any sense. By the way, you notice sitting back there, Roger Stone, of course, no, of course. Uh, and again, no real commentary to add there other than the fact that, oh, look, it's Roger Stone, because of course, just of course, of course, of course. Uh, but look, this is this is far right fundamentalism. It doesn't have to make sense. It doesn't have to be logically consistent. He doesn't believe in the First Amendment, and nobody's there trying to quote unquote impede your First Amendment. And by the way, what does it even look like? What does it even look like? What does he mean by Democrat games? Yes, are are there people that come and film some of his sermons and post them online, and to say, hey, look. Uh, that person's pretty crazy, right? Well, that's First Amendment. That's having an opinion. Are we not allowed to have an opinion? Are we not allowed to call you a psycho? Because that's what you're acting like. If you're talking about Second Amendment solutions, if you're talking about uh, just, you know, people who want to go uh, e even step in foot into your church or impede, which, by the way, again, I don't even know what that means. I don't even know the context here. But holy crap. You just have an open call to violence. Yeah, if, if somebody comes into this church and does something that I don't like, or he makes noise, well, uh, or, or plays quote-unquote Democrat games, which, again, I don't know what those are. What are the Democrat games? Are they like reindeer games? I don't, I don't, what does that even mean? No, it just means that anybody who comes to that church and maybe says something that I don't like that personally offends me, I'm going to shoot them. That's what you're saying. That's what this guy is saying. Yeah. Y yeah, you are pushing violence. Yeah. Yeah, you are. You are a domestic terrorist. That's what you are. At least that's what you're promoting. Disgusting. Completely unhinged. Encouraging people to do violence. Imagine if it were a, a you know, a cleric named Muhammad. Muhammad Muhammad. And he's over there saying, uh, we have, I, I have First Amendment. And uh, I have First Amendment to come in here and pray to Allah. And if somebody comes in here, we have the First Amendment, that we will use our Second Amendment because they would be American citizens, right? Uh, Muslims in America, hey, they have the same First Amendment rights that uh, Pastor Locke has. No, the rights here would be on fire if a uh, Muslim said the same thing. Muhammad, Muhammad and say, well, if you try to impede my First Amendment religious rights, well, then we're going to use our Second Amendment rights against you. No, those people would, you know what would happen to that mosque? A drone would destroy it. That's what would happen. But when it comes to Pastor Greg Locke, we just completely ignore it. We completely ignore the warning signs, the people that are saying, this is what we want to do, this is what we intend to do, we want to do violence, against people that we disagree with, that we think are impeding. And by the way, when it comes to it, can they ever really give a good example of how we're 
of how other people are impeding their religious liberty? The only examples that they give are people actually trying to live their own lives, trans people, gay people. Just the existence of transgender people and gay people and people who are atheists or people who are other religions, Muslims, that's enough to offend them. That's enough to, you know, uh, send them into a frothing rage to where they're, I can't believe we're being oppressed, that we can't oppress you, that you have a right to an abortion, you're into privacy. How dare you? No, no, no. We want to take away those rights because we think that's our right to oppress you. Fuck off. I'm not at all interested in your religion or your oppression. Shove it up your ass.